Retired state librarian Dorothy Dodd was in Florida during the Katz years. She even worked against him in the 1916 campaign. You remember Governor Katz, don't you? Of course I do. Good golly Moses. I worked in Mr. Knott's campaign office in 1915 when old Sidney was running against him and beat him. He turned prohibitionist so he could beat Mr. Knott. You don't think that was sincere, all of that Bible thumping? I don't th really think it was that sincere, really and truly. That fellow, Wayne Flint, I don't know whether you've ever read it or not, wrote a, a bi biography of him, Cracker Messiah, that uh, tell who gives him a pretty good bill of... Uh, after he got over the Bible thumping, as, as you call it. But that, that picture, you know, of him in the parade, this is the fold that got me here, and the boy was Rosia Katz, but his nickname was Shug. And I went to high school with Shug Katz and Alice Katz. Dodd remembers that Controller W.V. Knott ran his campaign for governor in a day when there was much less concern about conflicts of interest from his state office space in the basement of the old Capitol. And that's where his campaign office was. I folded, folded litter too and did all, and licked stamps and did all that kind of stuff. <laughs> Mm -hmm. the, in the film of Governor uh, Katz's inauguration, it looks like he's given one of his Bible-thumping speeches. I don't there. doubt it. I'm pretty sure I went to the inauguration, but I don't remember too much about it. I do remember, I do remember Suge, and I remember the, the parade and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It started off from the old governor's mansion. You remember the old governor's oh, yes, mansion. Oh, yes, yes, sir, I certainly do. And it's too bad that it didn't last, and it? It I don't care look. for this new stuff, just like I don't care for that skyscraper capital over there. I don't like new things. <laughs>